salutation to our departed family here. And it's called a Baisan. And we put our hands together, our hands together, and we're going to bow three times. One time is to the heavens, one time is to the earth, and one time is to mankind. So we first we go, Yat. Yi. Sam. And then Shannon and Ran and I are going to place our incense in front of the And I, I'll just say um, a word or two. I hope you can hear me. But um, And then we'll ask you to make some kind of orderly line. And each of you can go by and place an incense stick if you have one. And just enjoy a moment of um, your own contemplation with Bruce and Brandy. The incense is Richard has uh, some incense right here, so which way we can go this way. Um, this is Bruce's gravestone. In front of it is a book. And on the book it says, Our inspiration, your inspiration continues to guide us toward our personal liberation. As you know, Bruce lived and taught the importance of self-knowledge as a tool to personal liberation. And he taught that personal liberation is not an end point. It's not a place where you arrive. It is a place where you are always arriving. In other words, it's the journey that's important. It's not the destination. And Bruce lived his life like that. He enjoyed the journey every one of 32 years. On Brandon's headstone, I would like you to notice the shape of the headstone. If you look at it from above, you can see that the two stones are aligned to look like a yin-yang symbol. And the inside of the stone is left rough, and the outside is smooth to indicate the complementary nature of the of that is that because we do not know, we need to appreciate every full moon, every day, every minute of our life and be grateful for it. So in closing, I would just like to say that I believe that all energy is transformed. Energy does not disappear. As you know, these two men were full of energy, and their, with their mortal <laughs> passing, their energy did not go away. It's transformed into some other form. We don't know what it is. I'm not going to give a uh, theological message or metaphysical message. We all have our own thoughts about that. But one place I know where energy is transformed from these two men is into our hearts. And that is the essence of the inspiration that they have given each one of us. So with that, I would like to invite you to pass by here and have your own personal thoughts for Bruce and Brandon. And uh, that was very touching. Have a great day.